Jamie here with Mulberry Heights Homeschool. I thought I would just do a quick flip through for you guys on Evan Moore's Skill Sharpener Science Book. Um, I purchased the grade three. Um, it is available K through sixth. Um, when I first started researching curriculums, um, I found it so helpful that there was reviews on YouTube and Instagram. So I thought I would just share this for you guys. Like I said, just a quick flip through. Um, I really hope it helps somebody out because I know it really helped me when I first started researching. So here's the table of contents. There are four units. There's physical science forces, uh, life science cycles, life science changes, and um, earth science, earth and sky. So um, we just got this last week. So we um, are on forces in motion. Um, there's vocab concepts that are being taught, comprehension questions, uh, lots of visual aids, um, super engaging, super colorful, I love it. So does my nine-year-old, my husband enjoys it as well. So this is something we do as a family. Um, so there's hands-on activities that go with the concept that's being taught. Um, most of the needs um, you might have laying around the house. Um, and unfortunately I didn't have a balloon so I couldn't do this one just yet, but um, we did the friction in action. Yeah, it was super, fun for my husband and son to work on together. So a lot of the needs you, you know, you might have lying around the house. Some of them you might have to order, um, which I don't, I don't mind doing that. The activities are fun and they're worth it. So, um, again, if you're looking for something that has little to no prep, easy yet engaging, um, I would definitely consider this. So again, I'm just going to go ahead and do a quick flip through for you guys. Um, I will have a video of us doing the hands-on activity at the end, so if you want, keep watching so you can check that out. Um, and thank you for watching.
us what materials you used, okay? We, we, we used wax paper, we used paper towel, and we used, we crumpled the, um, the foil. Uh-huh. So we crumpled up foil. Why did we crumple it up? To make it more bumpy and rough. To make it bumpy and rough. Okay, so tell me first, before you do it, which one do you think is going to cause the car to be slow? So cause more friction. Which one? This one. Bumpy one? Yeah. Okay, what about the least amount of friction? The wax paper? Yeah. Yeah? I think. You think so? Why? Because it's smooth. Because it's smooth. Okay, let's. Let's see. Let's test your theory. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, you're right. Very good. Cool. What do you think about this? Was it fun? Yes. Yeah? Awesome. Cool. Do it again. Keep going. Yeah, we'll get three.